We've just uh, concluded a special cabinet meeting where, uh, the, attended by our ambassador, Canada's ambassador to the United States, David McNaughton, who's with me, and the other David, David Emerson, BC's special envoy to Washington, um, specifically focused on softwood. And we got a full briefing from both of them about uh, what's going on in the administration in the United States and talking a little bit about a, putting a plan together based on all of the work that our Minister of Forests, myself and our Forest Ministry, have been doing over the last year and a half or, or more than that to make sure that we try and reach a softwood lumber deal. With a new administration, there's always change. And one of the things we know from the last administration is we... Uh, couldn't get an agreement because the American negotiators were not interested in getting an agreement. The previous government in the United States was interested in making sure that they got the TPP done, but not as focused on the softwood lumber agreement. This new government is taking an opposite view on one, and we hope an opposite view on the other. So I'm confident that with, uh, with uh, Ambassador McNaughton, with um, David Emerson, whose rich experience you all all know well, and of course our incredibly hardworking forest minister, um, and a united industry in British Columbia, we have the team that we need to be able to get an agreement on softwood lumber because we in, we are going to fight for those 60,000 jobs and we are going to fight for those 140 communities that depend on an industry that ships four and a half billion dollars. Um, approximately a product south of the border to the United States.